What's up, what's happening? What is going on, everybody? A lot of high schools around the US are known for their ability to produce pro talent. Sometimes they produce more than one a graduating class. I'm Mike Cantalupo, and today we present NFL players who went to high school together. And a huge shout out to XXTFLXX for suggesting this video, XX. Mike Wallace and Kendrick Lewis, they went to O Perry High in good old Nolens. Uh, Kendrick's brother, Keenan, is an NFL cornerback who is currently a free agent. He also went there. Kendrick said that they are all brothers because they played on the same team. Wallace obviously is a speedy wideout. He has been for years. Kendrick is a safety for the Tennessee Titans. It would be cool to see them play on the same team. Keenan and Mike Wallace spent time briefly together with the Steelers. Alex Smith and Reggie Bush. This is a pretty big one. It happened in Helix High School in La Mesa, California. Not only did they both play on the same high school football team, but they were both 2004 Heisman Trophy finalists. Smith is now a three-time Pro Bowl quarterback. Uh, Bush was never really elite, but he was pretty darn good. I can't imagine having both of them against high school talent. Marquise Lee and Robert Woods. This is Sarah High School in Gardenia, or Gardenia, California. Yeah, uh, Woods was one year older. They both also actually went to become teammates at USC. Marquise Lee was the 39th pick in 2014 by the Jaguars. Woods in 2013 was the 41st pick. Uh, Lee has probably had the better career so far, but hey, it's early. Omar Bolden and Bobby Wagner. They both attended Colony High in Ontario, California. They led their school to the Central Division title in 2006. Bolden's Broncos and Wagner's Seahawks competed in Super Bowl 48 together. The Seahawks, obviously, as we all remember, won that game with ease, but Bolden got a Super Bowl 50 ring with those Broncos. They were close friends in school and both continuously helped each other through the struggles of heading into the NFL. Geno Smith and Stedman Bailey. Miramar High School in good old South Florida. Uh, they also, again, went to West Virginia together, obviously liked playing together. Uh, Bailey's former Ram teammate, Tavon Austin, was also at West Virginia. I mean, that doesn't really count. On a less fortunate note, Bailey was shot in a 2015 incident. Uh, so, yeah, I, I don't know what else to say. Uh, Smith is now a backup in the NFL. Stephen Gilmore and Jadavian Clowney. South Point High in Rock Hill, South Carolina had a couple good players up their sleeve. Actually, Gilmore was their quarterback at the time. Uh, former NFLer Devontae Holloman was also on the team. Gilmore is one of the NFL's better cornerbacks now. Clowney was obviously the first overall pick by the Texans in 2014. They're both morphing into really, really good defensive players. South Point must be really excited for them and must have also had a really good defense if, if they played both ways. Trey Waynes and Melvin Gordon. Mary D. Bradford High in Wisconsin. Gordon won many Wisconsin State Awards in high school. They were also best friends. Uh, Wayne was the 11th pick by the Vikings in 2015. Gordon was 15 by the Chargers. Wayne's development has been slow so far, but Gordon is now one of the NFL's top running backs. Brian Arakpo and Brandon LaFell. Both really good players here again. Lamar High in Houston. Arakpo also played basketball. They exchanged jerseys after the Titans Patriots 2015 game. LaFell won Super Bowl 49 with the Patriots. Arakpo is a four time Pro Bowler in his own right and is an extremely key player on the Titans defense. It would be really cool to see them both on the same team, especially since they are best friends. Giovanni Bernard and Philip Dorsett. St. Thomas Aquinas High School in Fort Lauderdale. Aquinas is the top team in America, like all the time, but they were the top team in America at the time they were playing. Uh, Bernard was a standout back then, and now he's a standout running back for the Bengals. Dorsett was a 2015 first round pick by the Colts. 
Uh, he's still really trying to succeed in the NFL. Bernard could be a thousand yard guy. St. Thomas Aquinas is known for bringing some of the best NFL talent out of South Florida. And these two are not any different. Teddy Bridgewater and Amari Cooper. They both went to Miami Northwestern Senior High, which is the other school in South Florida that produces a ton of NFL talent. Cooper caught passes from Bridgewater. Uh, yeah, they only spent a brief amount of time together. Uh, Bridgewater was drafted by the Vikings in 2014. Then Cooper was drafted by the Raiders in 2015. But can you imagine having a really good NFL quarterback pass to a really good NFL wide receiver in high school? That's what happens in South Florida. These teams are good. What other NFL players went to high school together? Let me know in the comments down below. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. Until next time, I'm Mike Canalupo. Thanks for watching.